you know a lot of time i've had people not everyone agrees with this when the bible says uh, suffer not a witch to live you know a witch must be must die must be killed and some they'll be like oh no now we have christ in the new testament yes we're not supposed to kill but give life blah 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 and that is true yes that's actually true but listen let me tell you in the book of Revelation, you can check chapter 2 and chapter 3 when he was talking about that woman, Jezebel, but I think it was chapter 2. The Lord made it clear that the, I've given a chance to repent, but she was unwilling. Hence, now I'm coming. Let me tell you that some people who just, no matter what, how much the Lord visits them, give them a chance, they decide that I will not stop practicing witchcraft. I will not stop wishing bad things for you. I will not stop wishing that things can fall apart. That is why such people at times, God, when he's in control, when he takes over, he has to destroy them. Because if not, this, they're going to do so as long as they live. They're going to keep hating people as long as they live. But that those that God knows, let them let me give them a chance. Perhaps they're gonna repent. Perhaps he's gonna repent. I think this one she has a heart. Like Paul, he was persecuting Christians, but God didn't just didn't decide to just kill him. He convicted him and give it, gave him a chance to repent, and fortunately he did repent. So listen, judgment is coming against that witch. It's not because you wish bad things and all, but it's because that person is refusing, and God knows they will never ever repent. And you will think that, oh, God never gave them a chance. No. When you say, God, take over, protect me from my enemies. Those who come against me, may you strike them. It's part of that prayer that you have made. Such people must be destroyed. Such people, God knows. Such people knows that this one must die. He must be destroyed because they won't repent. And I'm telling you, anyone who is coming against you and refusing to repent, the Lord is bringing judgment. Everyone who has practiced witchcraft, who has bound you, who has done whatever just to hinder you in life, to, to make you sick, to make you fail, to come against your marital life. They are failing woefully and God is bringing judgment against them in Jesus' mighty name. I also pray with you that every bewitchment that has been made against you is being nullified right now in jesus mighty name i pray amen and yes i'm ishmael and if you're watching me for the first time and i will see you next time